Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are going to be celebrating all things Van Life Festival. So I'm going to take you around the show and uh, see all the things that can be seen. Uh, hopefully take you down to the lake, go for a little bit of a swim and just enjoy a bit of the festival. At the same time I'm also going to be displaying in the Field of Dreams and that is a separate video, last week's video. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that or if you didn't watch it, I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> um, but yeah, t today's video is all about the festival itself, what it's like here, sort of traders that are on, things you can do, entertainment, etc. So let's get down to it. Right, I'm off for a swim. Uh, very exciting. Uh, yes, hopefully uh, the weather, the water will be steady enough for just a quick paddle. And uh, yeah, it should be quite lovely. <laughs> Now Sadie and I have had a walk around the uh, festival uh, seen lots of lovely traders um, I bought myself a new map for Jezebel which I'll show you in a minute and we um, saw some really beautiful jewellery uh, that I am thinking about treating myself to um, and now we're back having some lunch at the van so this is uh, yeah I didn't really get to see the traders or anything last year or any of the entertainment because I was working and I was tired. I look forward to the entertainment tonight. Tonight it's fancy dress and it's like a Wild West theme so I have my cowboy hat. So as well as traders and food places, My Life Festival also has live entertainment so music and workshops and such the like. Um, on a on each night, on the Friday night and the Saturday night, they have like a theme thing. Tonight is sort of that sort of Wild West American cowboys um, country and western music and uh, I'm gonna go to some of the acoustic things I think this evening yes I'm going to make an effort to uh, socialize <laughs> leave my van and uh, go and listen to some live music which I think will be really nice I did bring my cowboy hat and uh, some cowboy boots I did bring shorts but I think it's gonna be quite cold later so I might just I bought some jeans as well so I might just wear my jeans instead of uh, my, my uh, denim shorts and uh, go out in those instead but yeah should be uh, good fun and hopefully some cool music will be playing
and so we're back for day two of the festival saturday the busiest day hopefully later on uh, i'll be taking you around some of the fair showing you the rest of the um traders and all the stalls and things because i've only seen a very small amount of it uh, last night's live lounge was very nice uh, lots of fun music um, very nice sort of country western vibes they didn't even realize that it was a country western like theme kept querying why we were all wearing cowboy hats uh, <laughs> thought we might be taking the piss out of them um, but no it was really nice really chill evening and then I came back for a nice uh, early night as well so yeah hopefully I'll take you around some of the other bits of the show later on I'll show you um, some of the other traders and that that are going on in the area and uh, yeah, we can have a, a nice little stroll around the show together on a Saturday, the busiest day, because uh, they have day tickets coming in today as well. So not only is it the people camping, but people in the local area can buy a day ticket and come in to the festival and enjoy uh, wandering around and the stalls and all of that stuff. So busy day, very excited. Do you like my new hat? I bought it last night for one of the trading stands. Uh, I bought a froggy one last year, if you remember. So very happy to find a ducky one this year. Uh, so this is this is my new festival hat. I saw earlier that the tie-dye place is open today so I'm going to go and do some tie-dyeing. Um, I made one last year and I'd like to try my hand at it again this year and hope that I've made something uh, pretty. Uh, yeah, so that's the next thing to do. There's also a fun fair with a big wheel and I think I might go up on the big wheel and so I can give you like a view of, of the festival from the air. Uh, yeah, that might be quite fun and silly. So I might have some lunch, go on a tour and then go up on a uh, big wheel. Okay, I'm going on the big wheel. Uh, hopefully I get a nice view out over the festival for you. Uh, it's been a while since I've been on a big wheel.
It is the final day of the festival today. Yay! I've done most of the things that I wanted to do whilst here. So I went on the big wheel yesterday. That was great. Uh, <laughs> it goes really fast though for a big wheel. <laughs> it, was, it was quite fast, but fun. And then uh, I did some tie dyeing. I'm going to take my mum today to do tie dyeing because she missed it last year. And then because I went yesterday, my lunch break. She was upset, so I'm going to take her to, to go do some tie dye in this afternoon because she's not working today. And then, um, yeah, I think that's all the things I wanted, like to do. The, oh, there's a bushcraft, so I'd like to go into the bushcraft tent to see if I can learn a little bit about bushcraft. Um, that is uh, another thing I would like to do for the end of the festival. Um, last night went back to the live lounge for the acoustic scene it was again very nice very chill sat down by the uh, musicians near their tent area uh, their band area um, they were very nice let me stay with them because they had a big fire <laughs> and i was very cold the night before um, and yeah i got a cool uh, baseball cap which i'm not wearing right now i'm wearing my own one and uh, i also got a little they made me a little one of them made me a little keyring a uh, power cord, a little power cord man uh, for my uh, dry up for my van keys, so that was really sweet. So I just taken my mum to do some tie dyeing. Uh, I think she had fun. She got a uh, purple, blue, pink uh, sort of swirly pan, so hopefully it turns out nice. I'll try and get a picture of it once it's been washed and dried. And very warm today and therefore actually a much more chill vibe less people coming around um, more people sitting in the shade enjoying some drinks which is nice uh, not me not me because I'm gonna have to drive uh, start driving home in a few hours because I've got to go to work tomorrow so gotta gonna leave but it's been a really nice festival So as always, please do not forget to like and comment and subscribe to the channel. Uh, it always means the world to me uh, and yeah, trying to boost my subscribers up. I've hit the 300 mark now, so woohoo! Thank you all 300 of you. Uh, yeah, it makes me smile uh, to think that my little channel uh, that I don't really push at all is at 300. So thank you everyone. Thank you everyone who, is, who comments and everyone who shares the video. Um, and tells people to come and watch me like it's awesome thank you so much and i hope that you have enjoyed uh, this video at the van life festival 2024and that's it for Van Life Festival 2024. As you can see, I'm in Jez uh, and I'm just waiting to leave in order to get out of the festival and make my way back to Nottinghamshire. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please do like and comment and subscribe and I shall see you again on the trail. Bye for now, bye.